Join us for another crispy episode as Karen's and Kevin magnify the small details into a full-blown disaster. Subscribe for luck. Up first, we present you with this Kevin. He's totally intervening with his hotel staff and tries to make her look like a villain. She could have dragged you out, man. It's you that's nagging. So you gave my room to somebody? No. Anyway, um, do you want me to cancel the reservation or do you want me to send fax it somewhere else? Um, those are really the two things I could do other than else. Why are you so angry? I'm not angry. You are. You're angry. I'm not angry. So what do you want me to do, sir? Uh, I like the room here that, that, that I had that you told me would, would be here. We are booked here, sir. So either I can cancel your reservation or I can send it to a different location. What do you really want to do? Did you purposely give my room away because you had an uh, attitude with me earlier? So, um, I don't have any malicious intent. I'm really just trying to do my job. Um, so I can cancel your reservation or continue to a different location. Uh, what, what do you want to do? I like your, uh, Nothing. I can find it. No, thank you. I'm good. I'm trying you, wait, to, you're I'm good. Trying at, to help you. What was my question you thought? I'm was, trying to help you. You could help me by not having me to drive all the way out here. <clears throat> so I can either cancel your reservation or I can send you to a different location. What choice would you like to make, sir? I'd like, like to, not to be recorded either because that's really rude. I can give you my... No, no, no. no I'm, not, I'm being recorded right now. No, but you're recording me. Right now I'm being recorded. I did not give I'm you giving, my permission. I didn't give you my permission to be recorded either, but I'm being recorded as well. This is a workspace. Record. Well, I, I'm a, no, 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 you're, I'm a boss. You're recording me on your personal device. I did not Ma'am, I'm going to show the branch supervisor what I just okay, went through. So anyway, I can send you to a different location or I can cancel your reservation. What choice do you want to make, sir? What, what is this other place that you're trying to send me to? So we have a couple locations. Eden Prairie on Valley View Road and then there's Eden Prairie on Technology. There's these. Um, do you want me to fax you over to a different location or do you want me to cancel your reservation? We have not charged you since you had made uh, the reservation with a third party. You would have to call Priceline Expedia, um, whichever one that you had made the reservation with. Um, let's uh, do Egan North, please. Egan North? Okay, so when you get to the location, you can, um, you can call and then I'll just fax it over. Uh, why don't we call now to see if they even have a... Uh, open him, please. Please. I'm trying to help you, and you're being rude. I'm not asking. Did you? Did you say, wait. I know. Did you say you call the police on me? No. Just stop doing what you're doing. I'm trying to give you a rude. Don't be rude. always have to be us, huh? Bugging Karen gets mad at this comedian and accuses him of racism. If you can't take the jokes, then why'd you go to a comedy place in the first place, Karen? Go home. I voted for Joe Biden, but that didn't feel great. <laughs> <laughs> Felt like I was giving Grandpa the keys to the Oldsmobile <laughs> and telling him to drive to California. <laughs> That was the best of a bad situation. <laughs> I give credit where credit is due. I'm probably the most pro anti Trump no. comic out there. That no, mother. You're not. Shut the up! <laughs> up. As a white guy trying to talk to black people. I'm no. not. No, you're not. Yes, I wasn't. No, you were. You just you tuned were in. You were trying to. Well, I, you were trying to. For what? What are you upset about? It's not me. No, and shut up. Any black person ever tried to laugh at his joke? No. Stop having fun! <laughs> Go ahead, yeah. Stop having fun. Can we get her an Adder water or something? Wow. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah, no, that's oh, what happens. Black, no, you're white listen, trying listen, to like listen. talk about. No, and you. My probation officer is here now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who the you're mad at, but it's not me. No, a white person trying to make fun of black people. See, now you're crying, and we, I was just trying to make you laugh. No, don't do that. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> now I'm gonna make fun. I was trying to be no, empathetic. It wasn't funny. 
funny? It was not. No. Oh. I don't care. You trying to like laugh at that? How dare I add a comedy clip? She came here for a TED talk. Everybody knows you go to the basement for political opinion. I don't even know what he's saying, but it's just shit sounds tense. You <laughs> Why do you think I'm doing this for a living? You think I was a football player? I'm a god damn it. There's nothing you can say to me I haven't said six inches from the mirror. You're the first name going in my suicide note tonight. <laughs> Have a good night, Kamala Harris. <laughs> Now's the time I need you on my side. No, no, that was the most racist joke ever. No, no. I, I, I got no. like four more in the chamber. No. <laughs> Wait, don't Seriously? drop the scarf, man. That was three dollars at Dollar Tree, man. Oh. <laughs> yeah, go pick up the gun she left under the chair. This is the reason drugs are illegal. Look at this, Karen. Even in this state, she's ready to fight off these guys. And so bad that these guys are roasting her. Leave her alone with herself, man. Oh, bloody hell. You're rattling out, you love. You're rattling, love. Listen, what we done, what we done? Hello, what we done, what we done, though? You call me a child abuser. I am getting an interview tonight. I'm getting arrested. This is getting put on interview. Them GTTs are coming by the police. My, my word. Big up, big up, beast. Big up, beast. Big old beast, dude. Uh, I ain't got a shot, shot, but Melanie, you want what you want, you want it all, don't you? Huh? Hey, you want it all? Listen, you know, there's light in the kitchen, but it's happening. You, you've you just called me a child abuser. We'll hide you outside. You, we'll hide you outside. We'll you, 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 Oi! Come, 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 come. Let's have it, let's have it, let's have it. Let's have it, let's have it, let's have it, let's have it. Do a job back out, pop. I don't. Get away, get away. Oh, you come back to me? Get away. Yeah. You're gonna get me? I can't get people. Ooh! Ooh! You're gonna get me? You're gonna get me? <laughs> come, come stab me, come stab me, come, come, come stab me, come stab me, come, 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 stab me, oh, come stab me, come, 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 stab me, come, stab me, come, 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 stab me, come, 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 Your teeth are hanging out? Yeah. Okay, okay. You come inside. I show you, okay? Ah, I know it, sir. Oh, you Look are. Me, I'm making a scene. Yeah. You have to come to Are you sweet? You're sweet. You're Spain, man. I'm a. 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 Who did? Who did? You there. Get back to Pakistan. <laughs> Spain, man. Move. Spain. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a. Who did? Who did? You there. Get back to Pakistan. Oh, that's Oh, that's bad. Karen's and Kevin's are most seen at food restaurants. If you're that impatient, just cook at home and save the drama, Kevin. So cool of that employee to handle him so calmly. No, she told me she's going to get it. Forgot the last one. So if you don't have the number, you can actually find it all online. No, I'm not going online. I want to speak to the manager right now. I'm the manager. What's your concern? Okay, so I came to this up. She would talk to me because I'm white man. I assure you, you are not me. No, no, don't assure me. I go back with hell I'm talking about. 
But if you call them, maybe you're extremely sorry. Well, that's why I want to call. The planes are... Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, I want, I want, no, I want the head office. I want their number, and I want their email, and I want it now. You can find the email over here. Yep. Let's just Sorry. Listen, you're, you're trying to, you're trying to, you know, run around me here. I want head office's phone number and email, and I want it now. Three drinks and an ice cream. Abby's up there. Right, go, go with Abby. Okay. Our number didn't come up. I mean, it came up, but it went. That was, that was nice. We sourced out this drama. This pharmacist is being unreasonable by not giving out the medication. Who are you to decide, Kevin? Just hand over the medicine. It's not a drug. So you're discriminating against me. Why would it be discrimination? Uh, maybe because I'm Jewish? I don't know. What is it? <laughs> what? Every, like, what are you talking about? I'm not sure. Why would you not give me my medication? Um, it's because that there's no... We're not allowed to do it unless that person is in a clinical trial. For That's not true. I'm a prescribing physician for hundreds of patients. It's just not true what you're saying. Yeah, you shouldn't be doing that unless it's given an, an approval. Who, who are you to make that decision? You're just a pharmacist. You're not practiced. You're not licensed to practice medicine or surgery. That doesn't give you the right to control how I practice medicine. It's an FDA-approved medication, and I'm allowed legally to use it off-label. That's my right as a physician. Who are you to infringe on my rights? You're not a physician. You're just a pharmacist. Your job is to carry out the orders of the physicians. Not exactly. I have to do it as long as it's for the well-being of the physician. I agree. I agree. So it's not for the well-being of the physician. Who are you to decide that? No evidence of that. It's not for you to decide if it is. I think what you are doing is malpractice. It's malpractice as a pharmacist, and I really have to wonder. And my wife is a clinician of law herself. I'm not here to talk about you. That. That's okay. Your wife doesn't set policy either. I would There's no evidence against it. I mean, again, it's not your role. Against the use of it's medicine. again not your role to make that decision. I'm a prescribing physician who is licensed to practice medicine in the state of New York, and you're not. You don't know your place. That's all. I'm sorry. I can't tell you. Because, and I, I'm asking you to justify the reason why you're withholding life-saving med medication from me. That's all. I want to know why are you refusing to give me my life-saving medication. So you're also writing this for, you wrote on the prescription it was for lupus? And how do you know what my medical condition is or isn't? Is it your role to know that? What about HIPAA? Would you be able to provide evidence? I, I would, yeah. But I don't think that that's the standard of care so to provide evidence to a pharmacist. I don't think that that's right. You don't do that with other people. This is not a controlled substance. This is an FDA-approved medication. So I'm asking you to present evidence to you. Again, and I have the right to use it off-label. It's my right as a physician. I'm sorry if you don't know the laws. And the evidence is A1. Do that. that what? So that's your opinion, but again, it's not your job. It's not my opinion, it's coming from the National Institute. But it's of not your job. This man should have gone to another pharmacy instead of arguing with him. He's clearly done it with many patients before. Ridiculous how authoritative PA pharmacists can act. Yeah, to decide it's coming from PubMed, it's coming from up to date. So, There's so many clinical trials. I understand. So it's your opinion that this yeah, medication doesn't work. I don't want my name on a, prescript, on a prescription that has been dispensed for something outside of the labels that has been actually been proven so you, yeah. been shown to be. So you're saying, as a physician, as a physician, I think what you're doing is wrong. Okay, I hear that. I just want to understand. As a physician, you're saying that I'm not allowed to prescribe something off-label, and that's why you're not giving it to me? Off-label, that's kind of more of a gray area. I think it's because the state has told us specifically... Can I, can I see that, please? Can you show me those, those statements? Because I think you're just making it up. That is from the National Institute. That just says their opinion about whether the medication works or not. That's okay. They're allowed to have their opinion. But they don't govern how doctors prescribe. 
You're putting me in, in a situation where I need life-saving medication and you're not giving it to me. And for no reason. You're not providing any evidence except your own stubbornness and ego. And I, I think that this is criminal. 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 I still have the right to, to say no to a prescription that I deem to be, you know, harmful. How many times have you prescribed this medication, given out this medication? Hundreds. Do you do the same thing for every patient? To children, pregnant women? We haven't given it to anyone. For but that's not your role to decide. You're just a pharmacist. No, we follow, I mean, you're just very condescending. Just because I'm a pharmacist doesn't mean I don't know anything. But it's backed by um, evidence and from guidance from like- Just show me, show me the evidence. You're, you're making statements. You're preventing me yeah. from getting life-saving medication. Right there, you that's, that is just a piece of paper from NIH sta stating their opinion. That is not what governs prescription patterns. You're just creating okay. obstacles. Can't fill it. You can't fill it. Okay, so this is this is Walgreens Pharmacy in 306. This is a pharmacist. His name is, and he is refusing to give me life-saving medication, hydroxychloroquine, which I prescribe for myself, which I've been using for more than a year, and he's refusing to give it to me, and he cannot provide any evidence to substantiate his claims. So this is Walgreens and 306. Unethical and rude Karen refuses to pay her fare and gets kicked out of the train. She doesn't even say thanks to the person who's trying to pay for her. What an ungrateful, ill-mannered human. Next, this self-privileged Karen wants to know why this man is sitting in his car. Why, lady? Can't you just let people breathe? Ridiculous. Back up. Back up. Well, please. You better back up, lady. Please. Just go to your vehicle, please. I'm not this living is, here in two Listen, the listen lot that I live sweetheart, in. this is America. This is a free... I know Black Lives Matter. Get your out of here. Get your Ooh. out of this parking lot. Ooh, now... I can't believe this right now. I can't believe you. I can't believe your attitude. This is this is this is amazing. Why are you here? Why, Why are, are you harassing me? Is what I want to know. Because hmm. you have been sitting here. I've been watching. Enjoying myself, right? Enjoying myself, huh? <laughs> yeah, in this parking lot. Enjoying the sunshine. Just in, enjoying my business. Good. Go about your business. Get your business ass. Sweetheart, you just go hack. Enjoy your day. Look, your dog needs some water. 
Your dog, dog needs some water. Whatever. You need to give your, your, your pet some water. You don't have a sticker? You don't belong here. Hi, my name is Candy. And I don't like this guy. I I fear this guy. You fear I'm fearing you right now. <laughs> can, can you go back to your car, please, ma'am? <laughs> no, you just get out of here. This is my parking lot. You get your ass out of here. Oh. Get out oh, of here. Oh, wow. Get out of here. Now, get ma out of here. Now. <laughs> Ma'am, what can you calm down? What is what's wrong with you? <laughs> what is wrong I with you? I don't like you. You might is it my is it my is it my skin color? You have been you have been sitting here for more than an hour. You said that your mom lives here. You said your mom lives in nine one one. There's no such thing as nine one one. This is this black man harassing a white woman. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh. It don't yes. look like it because I'm in my area and you're not in your area. Can you go in your, your whoa, come on now. Back up now, ma'am. Ma'am, please, back up, ma'am. <laughs> now, this will tell you how problematic Karen's can be. Kevin flips out while waiting for pizza. It takes time to cook, man. Hand him over that uncooked pizza and get him to leave. Right now. You don't want to give me my food? You don't want to give me your seat start. Ma'am, I asked you to put a food out there. Can you give it to me? Manager, I asked you to put a food I paid for. Can you give it to me? You don't keep it going, me, correct? Yeah, that's correct. You said my wife needs to. You know, see, ignore me, right? Now, I'm sitting here asking for something I pay for. You're going to tell me no. Correct? I told you I don't know where to see it, ma'am. Can you give my kids a little bit? That's not my fault. You can go for something, sir. I'm not going to feed my kids. That's what you're telling me? My family and my kids because you ever well, seen the right? I'm, I'm, no, I'm just understanding what's going to happen before I get out of ready to tell me you're not going to get to beat my kids and I, and I work with you. So, I'm trying to understand what you're talking about, ma'am. I'm just asking for my fees out of pay for it, huh? I don't like it. Well, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm not going to give you my food. This bunch of Karens are fighting over a parking spot. They're dangerously increasing day by day. Hey yo, go go and go and park. You don't deserve this. Yeah, I just sorry, just leave it there. I'll I'll, I'll sit here. Oh, so you're sitting there now, so we yeah. can't get in? Yes. All right, Mum. What are you doing? Yeah. Have, you, have you ever thought of just, you ever thought of just, like, calming down? Well, congratulations, I've just had pneumonia. Congratulations, I've just had pneumonia. Yeah. And been in hospital. Surgery. What a shame. We all have our sub story, don't we? And there's no need to talk to people like that at all.
No need to talk to me about that. You're splitting their pot. He's going into you back there. Yeah. Yeah, so you're wrong then. No, because you're just being rude. You are. You're just being rude. So and what? there is no need for it. So what? There's just no need for We've it. We've been that? parked there, mate, half an hour. Don't care. Right, no, you wouldn't do, would you? Because no. you've had a parking space. And, and, and you're not, you're not understanding. Seven, I won't move. You're not understanding. And you're, parking up, you're... And you're not understanding why I can't. Yeah, I am you understanding. Rude. I am yeah. understanding. Can I ask you a question? I am a rude person, Let me right? Ask you a you're question. being rude. Sat there, right? Yeah. Let me ask you a question. Do you, do you have the internet? What do you mean, do I have the internet? Do you have the internet? Why? What's it got to do with you? Because I'm recording all this. So what? I'm not And you'll find it on Excuse all me. the social media. Stay not bothered. Your lovely Excuse me. And stuff. Excuse me, I'm not Stephanie. engaging with you. Bothered. Stephanie, that's, that'll do. That's Look at him now. He's part there. Can now, you move? So you we've been in. waiting to get in. Can we was the first people here. Yeah. well. Um, She's gonna park there. Yeah. Well, I've got come out of hospital and I've got. We was here before, then. You know that. She's now abusing this guy while he's being nice. Belittling people with a kind gesture is so common amongst Karens that they think it's a cool thing to do. Shame on them. No, I don't. Well, what's it got to do with you then? Oh, I don't know you. I just what's it got no, to do with you? Do you know me? Away. Ring the police, ma'am. Go on, ring the police. Fucking guarding things. Look at you, little chick. Oh. Get off the way. Well, Get congratulations. Way. Listen, we was here first. Congratulations on losing the argument. Like that. Because you've just been racist. So what are we not? Yes, you've just broken the law. What did she say? She just called me. Listen, a... I've been to prison. I'm not bothered about breaking the law. <laughs> you little crank. Stephanie, that'll go. Mama, I feel like punching him. Let me carry. I was here first. Out of all these people, I was here first. And I usually get in a disabled spot. And Two I can't. women, that's 70 Stephanie. odd year old, and you're sat there. Are you blocking this? Yeah. yeah, I am. Come on now, move it. So no. we... Well, what were we supposed to do? Well, because idiot, because I think you have you have acted in the most immoral well, and illegal we manner. Here first. Immoral. What has that got to do me. with you? It's Stephanie. got to do with everything. To that me. lady, you you were, you, you were absolutely abusive to that lady, and I've not heard an apology from you. Get lost. Oh, I'm sorry, that's assault. You've just touched me, that's oh, assault. You silly so old. if you would silly like... Sod. Get if the you would... police if you think I've assaulted you. Why don't you get the police? You're the one threatening. I'm not no, threatening not anything. Threatening. Please, will you just move, I'm not please. threatening I'm not anything. Well. Well. She's and I want to move. And we want to get packed so she can yeah. go in there. Well, why, why are you stood here shouting at me when you can I'm just go and, go, go and get out of your business? I'm not shouting. Well, you know, go sit in the car. I'm going to get out of here instead. Get home. He said that. Oh, you're going to push me in my hat. I said I'm feeling like. Oh. Get in your back. Oh. Are you, are you? Are you, are you done, love? Are you? Yeah. Excuse me, excuse me, van, van driver. Oh, he's going in now, so. Yeah, move your car now, Jake, move it. There you go. I am doing. Yes, I'm going to. Uh, yeah, you know, probably the best advice I've heard all day. Well, can you move, please, so I can move my well, the car. best advice is to move, please. I am moving. Because I'm going to pass I out. Actually, you well, sit down. Don't don't make yourself feel over this. Well, these people out. these people are the ones who are causing the stress. I'm not abusing. I'm I know you're not. I know you're not. And I'm really sorry you've got hooked up in this. I don't take that abuse off anybody. And I will forward this to the police right. for your racist behaviour. I'll forward it to the police. You're a little chinky con. How's that for you? Get yourself off. Right, that's that's it. You're unlikely to get parked for ages, love. Un Do you know what? I'd write her registration down. Yeah, I've got her on camera. I'd yeah. I know, I've, I've got her on camera. I'm sorry. I'd Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Well, welcome to Hull. <laughs>